Do you know? There are a number of different ways that a gun part can be manufactured. The most common methods include casting, injection molding, or machining. So what is the best method for a big gun factory, and what are their gun making process? Follow us through the video below. Explore the inside of the gun factory. While guns today have four basic components, a handle, a frame, cylinder, and a barrel, they can have many smaller, more detailed parts that aren't immediately obvious. Producing a well-built and reliable gun requires attention to detail and the design of each part. As guns must resist great pressure and power. However, the casting process can make the gun parts too weak to withstand this level of wear and tear. Besides injection molding, while cost effective, is less precise. Therefore, inside the manufacturing plants, they will choose to install by machining guns. The majority of guns are preliminary made for a variety of carbon steel, although they can also include stainless steel, aluminum, and other government-approved alloys. The main gun factory consists of several single-story metal buildings, like this one. Lots of natural light comes in through the windows, and the average worker is about 45 years old. I was amazed at the amount of skilled manual labor used to create each gun. As the manufacturing process of a gun includes many important steps, such as the design, machining, assembly, and quality control. The gun manufacturing process can vary depending on the gun type and manufacturer. After having its own blueprint, the factory began its work. First, the gun parts are built, as this includes the processes such as machining, which may include cutting, grinding, turning, milling, and foraging, heat treatment, and inspection to produce the parts such as the bell tubes, gun frames, gun arms, and mechanism shot, and many other parts. as the main stages will be done next. As at this point, the processing of the gun by assembling the parts together to produce a complete gun product. This process includes attaching components to the gun frame, mounting the firing mechanism, barrel, and gun rod and other components. These parts of the gun will then undergo initial inspection. 
it can be finished with layers of paint or plated to protect the surface and increase the aesthetic. Finally, the gun will be packed and prepared for shipping to distribution locations or the end customers. The gun boxes are attached with the manufacturer's name and the symbol to promote as well as to ensure the prestige brand and the quality. All processes for gun machining, in addition to using the labor force, many designing equipment and machines are controlled by their computer in a modern monitoring room to create the shaped gun parts. The perfect size and fit, as it is that simple, isn't it? Gun manufacturing is a complex process and it requires strict adherence to regulations and safety standards. In addition, the production and possession of firearms must comply with the provisions of the law and be carried out only by the manufacturing facility and the competent authorities. As guns bring positives in the military operations of many countries, but also brings negatives if they are used illegally. As this is the end of our video for today, did you find it useful? Please leave a comment down below to let us know and don't forget to click the like, share and subscribe button to support the channel. And for now, goodbye and see you in the next video.